Thanks for staying with us at 6 o'clock. Plans are in the works to tear down a historic home in Meade County. WDRB's Dakota Sherrick and photojournalist Jeff Gordon share why hundreds of community members want to stop those plans. This home has been part of the Meade County School District for several years now, but recently the district has decided to demolish it. And now many in the community are fighting to save it. When you walk on the property, just the piece that's there and the, the depth of the house, the, the, it, I just couldn't imagine it being completely destroyed, just gone. The Virginia Allen Miller home was built in 1870. The Meade County School District purchased it from the Miller family in 2017 after Virginia, a former teacher in the county, died. She was uh, 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 very fond of the school and very fond of the of kids. She was important to the community. Dedicated in Miller's name, the district says it has made investments in repairing the more than 150-year-old home. But in April, the district's school board made plans to demolish the house after an inspection found a number of issues. Sadness for me. Um, it, it's, um, it's hard to lose landmarks. The district told WDRB in a statement it won't spend any more money on the deteriorating home but will instead continue to invest in students' education and teacher salaries. There's other options. Leisha Duke started an online campaign to save the historic home. The online petition has more than 900 signatures. I think this would be a wonderful thing to have the community and the school district, you know, working together to try to save this home instead of it just being demolished. Duke says some of the Miller family have expressed issues about mold and asbestos, but she believes the community would help with repair costs. It's important that this house stays, and if, if Mee County Schools can no longer afford to maintain it, then maybe they should look at either giving it back to the family and they can figure that out or give it back to give it to the community and let us take care of it because it is a part of us. It's a part of our history. A piece of history Duke believes can continue to be used for education and to carry on Miller's legacy. Though it won't be on the agenda, some community members do plan to bring up this issue at the next school board meeting. In Meade County, Dakota Sherrick, WDRB News.